In this video, I will show how to upgrade AWS RDS PostgreSQL database. For the past four months, this AWS account has been billed a significantly higher amount than usual. Most of it comes from Amazon Relational Database Service. Let's check the bill. From the drop down, select previous month. Here you can see Relational Database Service. It is 404 USD. Click on the plus to expand. Here you can see most of it come from RDS extended support for PostgreSQL 11. In order to avoid this extra cost, we need to upgrade the RDS PostgreSQL database version 11 to a supported version. To find the end of life for PostgreSQL, search for PostgreSQL end of life. Click on the second link. That is the official website. Here you can see the version 11. The final release is in November 9, 2023. The version tool end of life is November 14, 2024. Today is August 8, so only three more months left. The version 13 end of life is November 13, 2025. We will upgrade to this version. Search for RDS. Click on RDS. The region is Germany. From the drop down, select Frankfurt. Click on DB instances. These are the two PostgreSQL RDS databases. Click on the first database. Let us take a snapshot before upgrading. From the action, click on take snapshot. Snapshot name before upgrade. It is creating the snapshot. The status is creating. Let's wait for the snapshot process to be finished. Let's see if the snapshot is completed. Here we have a message, successfully created snapshot. Here the status is still creating. Let's refresh the page. Click on the refresh icon. The snapshots are now available. You can see the date created, August 8, 2024. Click on the databases. We will update the staging database first. Click on the staging database. Click on modify. You can see the DB engine version here. From the drop down, select version 13. Scroll down. Click on continue. Here we have a warning. Are you sure you want to upgrade your DB instance? Once a DB instance has been upgraded, you cannot convert it back to the previous version. We have taken a snapshot. So in case we need to revert back, we can use the snapshot to create a new RDS database. Here we have two options. Apply during the next scheduled maintenance window or you can apply immediately. I will go with apply immediately. Once we click the modify DB instance, the version will be upgraded immediately. If you have a busy application, you may need to upgrade during the maintenance window. Click on modify DB instance. You can see the status is upgrading. The staging database upgrade is completed. Status is available. You can see the version under configuration. Engine version 13.13. .13. Thank you for watching. Hope you find the video useful. If you like the video, please subscribe for more videos like this.